Hi guys, it's Chicago, Chicago Police, and today we got some news from the Chicago Cubs that the Chicago Cubs just released another catcher, Jose Wobaton. He was drafted, uh, nowhere. He got picked up, I think. I don't know what I say here, but he got picked up by San Diego in 2009. He debuted at 7-5, 2009 for the San Diego Padres. Then he played in tiny Neatway play, uh, 11, 12, 13, 11, 12, and 13 played for the Tampa Bay, 14, 15, 16, 17. Played for Washington and 18, played for the Mets, and then he played since. Then he went to the, I think he went on the Dodgers group, was on the Dodgers squad, didn't, didn't play for them. And then now, he was on the Cubs uh, South Bend squad this year, and then they released him after they picked up a couple of players. A player today and the end of the players that he cut him. His 28 stats were 49 at bats, 3 runs, 7 hits, 0 home runs, 4 RBIs, 0 stolen bases, 0.143 average, 0.24 OPP, not 0.470 OPS. MLB career, he had 1,134 at bats, 109 runs, 244 hits, 21 home runs, 107 RBIs, no stolen bases. 0.215 average, 0.293 OPP, and a 0.612 OPS. And I don't think that's a good idea to like, drop him because I don't know how many catchers left they got. They have four catchers on the Cubs roster right now. Two are actually catchers. One, if they really need him, he can play catcher. He played a college catcher. And then one, this year they were, uh, he was practicing with his brother or whatever, catching. Or in bullpen catching, I mean, sorry, one person. Then we got Caratini and, Car and Contreras are catchers. They're not going to be doing DH and catching because they don't have any more catchers. They can't get injured. Because you can get injured batting. Like, what Ian Hampton got injured. And then they have backup Schwarber if you they really need him because they got a lot in the outfield. They can have Hap, Mabin, but, uh, Bias, uh, Brian could go in the outfield. They need him too. Hamilton, if you really need him to go play there. Bodie can play in the outfield if you need him to. So, yeah, you have a lot. Like, Baez, now Bodie, Bryant, Kevin, maybe Jose Martinez can play in the outfield too if you really need him. And then you're going to have Schwarber if you really need him to catch. catch. And then you got Baez too can catch because he was doing that in the offseason. And uh, after, then basically after when the virus hit, he was doing that too. And yeah. So much guys. Cubs just dropped and released another catcher from South Bend to add another player. And they just got today. They picked up in free, uh, waivers. They dropped Jose Robertown. He's going to get picked up by a club that needs a catcher. Like a backup catcher. And yeah. Anyways guys. Kelly Chad. That was a good idea for them to drop Jose Robertown. It was a bad idea. I think it was a bad idea. I don't know how many catchers left they got. And he's been decent. He's a veteran. He played for teams and stuff. So. I think he should he should he should have stayed just to stay there. But they need to make room for players. Then I guess he they can drop him. Anyways, guys, it's kind of can it was a bad idea for the Cubs to keep good idea or bad idea to keep Jose Wobotone. Mm -hmm. Anyways, guys, this guy plays. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.